Yes! Wow, that was quick. We catch the boy. And of course, Upa could ride the Nimbus. Hi, everyone, and welcome to another Dragon Ball reaction. Before we begin, as always, thank you to the patrons on Patreon. If you want to join us on Patreon, the link is in the description. Go check it out for early access to our footage and exclusive content like filler episodes and movies that are only on Patreon. If you're watching this on YouTube, please subscribe to this channel. Also, subscribe to the ton of other channels that we have, which are all within the link in the description. Last but not least, check out our merchandise, which is also within the link in the description. Like this video, comment down below. And with all that being said, let's get started with this reaction. How do you get the umbrella? And the camel. Knowing him, he beat somebody up for it. For some conditioner. This Look at the pinky. absolutely murdering my hair. Uh, it's that little runt's fault that I'm stranded out here like this. I promise he is going to pay for every single split end. Dude, how is he not dead at this point? That is so crazy to me. Arali literally kicked him into a new world. Well, the desert. <laughs> Meanwhile, back at HQ. Somebody's gonna scare him right now. Enter! Excuse me, Commander. But the boy has been tracked traveling west, just as you expected. Bingo. Hmm, right into the hands of Captain Yellow. Uh. That reminds me, has he been able to locate the Dragon Ball yet? No, sir. He's had quite a few setbacks. Well, that figures. Enough! I've had it with all these silly games! None of them can find the Dragon Balls. He's pretty good. Oh, this thing is here again. That was very impressive. Yeah, he's really good at uh, billiards, pool, whatever you want to call it. So now we're going to see Commander Yellow. Or something. General Yellow. Captain. Oh, Captain. Captain Yellow, yes. Man. It's hard to keep track of all of their rankings. <laughs> I agree. Baffoons. They've been digging here for days now, and no results. This is yellow? Has to be. What you want? Captain Yellow, sir, we have located the Dragon Ball. I am looking at it right now. Where is it? It's down there, sir, just below us. Of course it's in a volcano. I don't see anything. I can't put my finger on it. Greater, sir. It's there. But when we watched that intro scene of Dragon Ball Super that? Superhero, I think Goku like slammed a power pole right on his head. Oh. I don't know how we're going to retrieve it from down there. Helicopter imbecile, we take the helicopter into the volcano. Yes, sir. He's Australian. Wow. Do you hear the accent? It seems like they're kind of in Australia, possibly. There's no countries in the Dragon Ball uh, world, but and also the. Sub version of this probably has no accent. <laughs> you're so right, you're right. <laughs> this is all a dubbing thing. Stylistic touch. Whose tower is this? Corin! Wow, it's beautiful. As far as you can see, and then some. I'm gonna grow up and catch all the fish in the ocean. Son, you should not take more than you need. If you respect nature, she will always take care of you. This character was in Z very briefly, was in the say, spirit bomb moment. I remember them. He recognized Goku's voice. I can't wait to find out who he is and like, what his backstory is and everything. He's brolic, dude. Yeah, <laughs> this guy is amazing. <laughs> He's freaking jacked. Nice. Very well done. Yay! That was so fast! Oh, Daddy, you're the best! Huh? 
Dang! Does he know some martial arts himself? Clearly, look at him. That's impressive. And he got the fish. Two fish. <laughs> One's in his stomach. Do not cry. We were never in any danger. We live under the watchful eye of the Guardian. I like this character. We must thank him for protecting us from harm. Seems peaceful. All of those characters are super peaceful and very well mannered. He seems like he's based off of a Native American. Yes, I like he was teaching lessons to his son about not overfishing. Which is completely different than Nam, who reminds me of somebody from India. Yes. Who's the lucky guy on the pole? I have it! Now get me out of here! Come on. Oh, oh no! Oh wow. What bad luck, man. Oh. Just because you removed the Dragon Ball? No, it was just coincidence. The Red Ribbon Army really fails at trying to find these balls. I think they do a good job, actually. Well, they're very close every time. If it wasn't for that meddling little kid named Goku. <laughs> Mount Kana has been disturbed. Or the volcano. Something is wrong. Oh no. Oh shoot. Wow. This whole place is gonna catch on fire. Mm -hmm. Will Corrin save them? They seem to trust him a lot as their guardian. Now, call back headquarters and find out exactly where the Dragon Ball is gone. Yes, Captain. Culling base. Base, come in. Come in, base. West. The Dragon Ball has moved approximately five miles to the west. Copy that. Troops, head west immediately. All of those balls that were getting thrown out of the volcano, one of those had to be the Dragon Ball. It's over. Daddy, are you okay? Yes, no damage done. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, you were so right about that. Was that the four star ball? Yeah. It is a four star ball. I'm so excited. Hmm. What is that thing? I do not know. I have never seen such an object before. Oh, it's so pretty. It almost seemed like they were trying to hide the fact that it was a four star ball because one of the stars were like, the opacity wasn't to the maximum level. So. Well, whatever. This is as good a place as any to set up tank. Soldiers, prepare to land! This is getting huh? so interesting already. <laughs> Daddy, those gigantic birds are gonna land on us! Hmm. Those are not birds, little one. Those are vehicles called helicopters. Crazy. To think that aviation developed within a hundred years. Yeah. So, like, we went from the first ever powered flight in like 1903 or something to like having fighter jets in like a hundred years, which is crazy. Which is also why the kid doesn't know and Goku didn't know what wow. those vehicles were. I oh, can't yeah. believe anyone would live out here by choice. <laughs> Who are you? Oh yes, I'm Captain Yellow of the Red Ribbon Army. We'll be setting up our mobile headquarters right here. Here? 
And there's plenty of work to go around so we can put a big fella like you to oh, good no. use. No, oh, thanks. shoot. I think they're going to have to fight. Leave. This is no place for people like you. Now go. <sighs> I wasn't asking for your permission. Oh. Captain Yellow sounds like an orc from World of Warcraft. If you know, you know. <laughs> he looks so ready for them. Captain Yellow, do you see what's in his hand? The Dragon Ball. Now, hand it over, you painted peasant. You will receive oh, nothing from so me. so rude. Whatever. Pulverize him! Oh, shoot. I really don't want him to get hurt. Holy crap. This guy's strong as hell. I'm really impressed by this character. He also looks really cool. I love the necklace and everything. The face paint. Mm hmm What the? No, no way. <laughs> Guns are but useless toys. Get me my spear, Upa. Sure, Dad. Upa. Upa is the little kid. <laughs> that was a good throw for that kid. Do you have any idea who you're tangling with? You better turn over the ball before you get hurt. The ball is of no concern to me, but this is sacred land and I am here to protect it. You must pay for the destruction you have caused. Sacred land? You gotta be kidding me, this dumb... It is the truth. The guardian of our people was born here, and this beautiful monument was built to honor him. Wow. He still lives here today, high above us at the top beautiful. of the tower. Did you notice those beautiful decorations, like, within the Maybe base of the tower? Otherwise, be prepared to face my wrath. I like how they got into the history of the tower and everything. Daddy, look out behind you! <laughs> Oh, that's sick. What a badass character, man. Seriously. <laughs> man, destroy him. <laughs> and here comes little Goku. Looks like the Dragon Ball stopped moving at least. He's gonna make some friends. Don't you see? Guns can't hurt me! I actually have a feeling that this guy's gonna think Goku's an enemy as well. Really? How could you think that's such a sweet boy? Initially, at least. Until Goku starts explaining himself. I wonder if Goku will trade all the other balls he has for the four star ball after he explains what it is. If this guy knows Grandpa Gohan too, I'm gonna be like, come on, dude. Imagine <laughs> he competed in the World Martial Arts Tournament back in the day. You know what? I think you might be right about that. Stay here while I dispose of these troublemakers. Okay. Such a masculine character. Such a great dad too. Look at the little boy. His eyes are like glimmering He's for his father. Ad admiring his dad. Are you there, headquarters? Sir, Captain Yellow sounds frantic. He's calling on the radio right now. Captain? What? The men were overpowered and only you could escape? What happened to the Dragon Ball? What a ball? coward. Uh, we, uh, we, we ran into a bit of a snag. Enough with the excuses, Yellow. Retrieve the Dragon Ball at all costs. It's more valuable to this army than your life. Holy shit. It really be like that? <laughs> order. Can't you handle anything right? <laughs> Commander Red. Here, listen up, Yellow. Hello, Commander Red, sir. You have exactly one hour. That is 60 short minutes to bring me the Dragon Ball or else I'll be forced to send in Tau. Did you say Tau? But, sir, mercenary Tau, isn't that a bit excessive? Can it? I need the ball and the kid eradicated so I can complete my plans. Do you remember course, Tao? If you fail, yeah, Tao will I do. Exterminate From you along with whoever else gets Dragon in his Ball way. Z. Keep that in mind. Do you I remember when we saw him? Obstacle? He has a son. Yeah, I can't remember if it, the it was a filler arc, but he was really scared of Goku. 
It was a couple of filler episodes before the Cell, Cell games began. Yes. And Goku and Gohan were transformed in their Super Saiyan state. <laughs> and then he saw them again. He's like, hey, by the way, is your name Goku to Gohan? He's like, no, that's my dad. Don't hurt the boy. No. Oh, oh took him as hostage. He, yeah, he kidnapped the kid. That was some awesome flying, though. Oh, this is bad. His dad's gonna have to throw something at that airplane. He might actually trade the Dragon Ball. Now, fool, if you ever want to see your son back, give me the ball. Just toss it right to me. Understand? Honestly, that was pretty well played for it Yellow. He's got everything under control this time. We may have this Dragon Ball in the bag, but we still have a problem. The kid. Excuse me, sir, about that. It looks like the boy has almost reached Captain Yellow's location. <gasps> oh, shoot. Perfect timing. Of course! He's just in time to mess things up! Here is your ball. Come down here and get it! No way! That's a trick! You'll hurt me if I come down there! Throw it to me! No, I, I am it. true to my word. I am not as despicable as you! Dude, Goku, save the day, man. Close to it now. Here we go. <laughs> Who is to help me? What? It's Upa. It sounded like a girl. He's a little kid. <laughs> Throw it up here. Yes. <laughs> hey, I've seen a symbol like that before. What's that? I know. That plane belongs to the Red Ribbon Army. And just who might you be? <laughs> yes. Wow, that was quick. We'll catch the boy. And of course, Upa could ride the Nimbus. Yes. Right? He should be able to. He's so sweet and innocent. <laughs> Hello. <sighs> Automatic best friends. We have lost contact, sir. Is Yellow dead? You know what to do. Poor kid. I kind of feel sorry for him. I'm sure Tao's going to work him over pretty good. And that's putting it mildly, I would think. I've heard of people keeling over just because Tao looked at them funny. Imagine, what if he actually used his fists? <laughs> they think they have the secret weapon against Goku. Thank you for saving my son. Oh, you know, it was nothing. No trouble at all, really. Thank you. You're nice. <laughs> uh. Grandpa Gohan's ball. There we go. We got a clear view oh, of the four star. It. The Dragon Ball. It's right huh? there. Please, can I see it? Hmm. Oh, so you were looking for the ball, too. One, two, <laughs> three, four. Freaking Dora the Explorer, the man. <laughs> can you count to four? I my grandpa's Dragon Ball. I'm surprised you can. <laughs> what is this Dragon Ball, and why do so many search for it? Hmm. <laughs> I can't believe Yellow's not in the picture anymore. I think he's deceased. Which is crazy, because this mofo survived like a hundred episodes. <laughs> he's hey elite. Man, no trespassing unless you want a bruising. That's right. You just keep pushing me, buddy. Destroying him, them right now. With his eyes. Hmm. <laughs> or his fist. <laughs> I like the eye idea. And look How at the blood, by the way. They forget when you're gone. General Blue! Quit your blubbering and open the gate. Oh, I'm excited for this. They're gonna meet again. Whoa. Oh, this is not... The menacing General Tao. Mercenary Tao, sorry. At he does your look service, scary. I am Mercenary Tao. 
He sounds like an Imperial Guard from Warhammer 40k. At your service. But how long can he hold on to it? Now that the Red Ribbon Army has called in the infamous mercenary Tau to take it away. Find out in the next action-packed episode of Dragon Ball. Okay, so full disclosure, I know you haven't seen it, but I've seen some of the battle between Goku and Mercenary Tao. So I'm going to keep my mouth shut the entire time as that's happening. That being said, this was an awesome episode. I love Upa and his father. I don't think they disclosed his father's name to us, but I'm sure we'll find out in the upcoming episodes. I'm really glad that everything is getting a little bit more serious again, and I'm looking forward to seeing Goku climb Korin's tower. I mentioned this earlier in the episode, but I can't believe General Blue is still alive. I don't understand how he's going to continue continue to play into the plot and I'm very curious to find out. With that being said, we'll see you guys on the next exciting episode. Thank you so much for tuning in. Stay tuned and peace out. Bye!